work in a variety of media, or I have over the years. Um, I painted for a long time. I think the medium is informed by where I'm at in my work and what I'm trying to accomplish. I'm usually just inspired by confusion and feeling out of my depth in life. And art is a way for putting a wholeness back together, uh, figuring out my place in the world and stepping back and having um, a kind of perspective that we don't generally make time for. I'm interested in looking at identity and how people coalesce or create their identity and how we see that in, in society and in our cultures and how that's visually manifested. Study of man and what makes man uh, different from in different places where they live and how that creates one's uh, personal identity and all the different facets of what a person can say about themselves or be and how that can change. My pieces tend to be psychodramas. I enjoy working with situations that we all tend to go through or maybe fear. So in that way, I'm addressing what is basic in all of us. I joined the Baton Rouge Gallery in 2002. I've spent some time in other cities, and when I decided to move back here, I felt like it was the absolute best place for me to show my work. It's a place where artists can show the work that's most important to them without concern that it's going to be edited or limited in some way as a result. The Baton Rouge Gallery really shows the community what art is, you know, and in an environment that is accessible. They'll see this different side of life that maybe they had never encountered before. I want those people to be part of my life. I want people that are not interested in art want to be more interested in it, you know? And I try to make work about all different types of subject matter, so hopefully all different types of people will want to look at it. So very fortunate to have a contemporary gallery, which the artists have a great voice in. It's a place for innovative work, for intellectual stimulation, I'm honored to be a member of Batmerish Gallery.